How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Steam World Dig. Oh, I'm enjoying this game so much. This is three. This is gonna be the third straight part I've I've done without taking a real break. I mean, I've taken bathroom breaks between each of them, and you know, refilled the coffee, and now I'm off coffee and onto water. So, but yeah, it's been three straight parts. I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. I, I'm gonna keep saying that because. I can't really understand why no, but why a person wouldn't enjoy this. It is just fantastic to me. So we're gonna jump right back into this one, and uh, we whoop, hold on. Wait, I, I wasn't gonna do anything. Okay, that was dumb. But uh, last episode we went on a second expedition into the mines, uh, leveled up, I believe, once. We should be level three. Um got a ladder mysteriously from somewhere. I don't know where it came from, but uh, wherever it came from, we got a ladder. I still am not seeing the point of those yet. There probably is a very big point for them, but at the moment, wall jumping seems like the best idea. Unless you can't reach, oh, unless you don't have something to wall jump off of, perhaps, but that's only if you're dumb. I mean, who would put themselves in a position where they can't wall jump. But, uh, enough about that. We also got our medium pouch and got some fat loot, including bronzite. And we, as you can see on the map, we dug down some ways. This episode, as I promised, we're going in to do our mission. We're going to go do the cave. See where that goes. It's cave number one, it says. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. For the cave. We will do the cave, I promise you. I am not going to leave you guys hanging like that. Before the cave, though. Even you are probably thinking, like, oh, dude, don't go in the cave, there's loot there. I'm going to get the loot. Get all the loot. Every loot. Every single loot there is. It's going to be ours, even if it's worth $1 or $50. The loot is ours. And uh, Unless, you know, we have to drop it at some point for better loot. Which, you know, the chances of there being better loot in this cave is understandable, but we have not been in a cave yet, so... Let's see where this takes us. Oh, it's a different area. A different area. New map. And it looks like there's stuff over there. There's stuff over there. Get that cursor out of there, Scott. You're annoying people with that. Is there broken stuff up there? Is there something that could fall through there? I am so... Get it. That was neat. I'm a fan of that. <gasps> oh, yeah. I knew it! <laughs> if he can break it, why can't I? <laughs> That's so fun. Oh, I've never had that much fun breaking a block in a game, I think. I am a little worried, though. Like, if it appears and it, like, while you're in the location of it, if it will kill you, I can't even jump across it, really? Do I have to, like, hop? I want to go on that ladder. Can you go on ladders? It looks like it's just part of the backdrop. Okay. Oh, just yes, but Okay, well, this is not annoying. This is fun. If you think this is annoying, I apologize. This is what we picked up last time. This thing is what we picked up last time, and there was a blue part of it I didn't know. It seemed like it was health, fuel for your lantern, and some sort of water thing. So we're going to pay attention real close. We're going to go in our inventory and see what we have here. Uh, for our tools is Q. I think it's Q. It should be Q. Where's the... That is not Q. It is W. Okay, W. We have one ladder and two lamps. So... And we have three trashium. So we're going to see what this does. We'll watch our health and stuff. Okay, it filled our health up and it filled our oil up a little bit. Now let's check. Is that what gave us the lantern? Or the ladder? No, it isn't. Okay, so I still don't know what that water thing does. If somebody knows what that does, let me know in the comments, because I'm still new at this. I've never played it before. <gasps> spikes! Okay, there's spikes. This cave is proving to be a bit more challenging. Oh, this is beautiful. What is that? Oh, I I'm, I'm gonna theorize. I'm gonna theorize. I'm gonna theorize. That is a Chozo statue. That is a Chozo statue. I'm getting upgraded. Please be a Chozo statue. <clears throat> bzz, bzz, bzz. Speed boots! 
Technology assimilated. Return to town. I don't want to return to town. There's so much to do here. Left shift to run. What did I say? What did I say? Oh. Space is always jump. Shift is always run. All the running. Every run. <gasps> but I want that. <gasps> oh, oh, yes, yes. I think I found a use for the ladder. I can't use the ladder. Why can I not use the ladder? S. But I want to use the ladder. So unfair, game. There's stuff here. You're telling me to go back to town, and I don't want to go back to town yet. You are not understanding the inner RPG mind of a gamer, or the mining mind of a gamer. Oh, there's another one of those things. I want to find out what those do. Left, shift, run, jump. Oh, can I double jump, basically, or get reach higher heights with my jump? Let's find out. <gasps> oh, okay, I'm watching that again. That animation was sick as hell. Look at that art style. Oh my god. I hope you guys are seeing that as clear as I am because that is fantastic looking. No, no, no. There's stuff to be had. All the exploring. Uh, oh, that is sick. Is that a... That better not be what I think it is. Is that a Metroid... Like, reference Easter egg kind of thing? Oh, those are orbs. Those are those things we knew about that we didn't know about that we want to know about. I'm gonna get it. I get it. Oh, oh, missed. Can you jump around an edge onto another edge, I wonder? I'm gonna try this for a couple minutes, and if it doesn't work... Okay, no, there's a cave entrance thing up there, though. Looks like an entrance back to town up there. There are heavy ass metroidvania stylings here like get an upgrade reach new areas that is basically everybody's favorite thing about metroidvania style games and this is having so many different influences i'm finding different influences from so many games i grew up with it's just fantastic is there any more loot we can get before returning i mean okay so there must not be fall damage because i felt some pretty pretty hefty length there I am a robot. I mean, you would figure there'd be fall damage. I'm jumping, not attacking. Attack, 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 attack. Oh, we're getting close to that six, that times six area down there. We have... F Damn it. We have fuel left, so why the hell not just keep going get loot? Oh, bad guys. Got some baddies. Go over here so we can see more distance. There's some loot. Loot and baddies. And then we can loot the baddies. What is this? Copper. Copper! Time it right and not take any damage from you. Um, and we took it. Took the health back. That's fine. Got some loot. Because we didn't really get much loot on the way to that cave. Or in the cave, rather. Iron. Iron. Ugh. Wow, that's difficult to say. Iron. Ironium. Ironium, because you can't say Ironium, like how you would say iron. Ironium? That sounds like a very, very troubled person trying to say Narnia. Ironium. Sorry, that might have been offensive. I apologize. You'll, you'll learn over time that I'm not very sensitive to a lot of, like, controversial things and stuff like that. I just, I just say things. I don't think about what I'm saying. If you're offended, let me know in the comments. I'll try and behave myself a little better. But just know that anything I say is not meant to be offensive. Is this to it? Yes. I'm learning the controls, people. Three episodes in and I'm learning the controls. Ah, oh, God, I don't want to use any more lanterns, but I do want to get more loot before we go back up. I mean, it, that, that mission didn't really give us a whole lot of loot. That furnace should definitely light up more than it is. I'll say that much. <gasps> Let's hope there's no boulders. No boulder. I want to go over there. That's that's somewhere we gotta go. Oh, it's a cave. It's a cave. We have no light, so we're gonna make a path to the cave. Okay, 
Nothing up there. There's a boulder below us, though. And bad guys. Okay, we're going to kill the bad guy. It looks like a different bad guy. That guy looks... Oh, he's the same guy. It's just dark. It's harder to see him. We're going to go make a path to the cave. And then we're going to go back up. And we might come back down here. We might, we might go get some more loot, though. I mean, I really do want that next pickaxe. Especially because we're treading towards the... We're in the times 5 area here. And we are heavily treading towards that uh, times 6 area. Can we, like, jump? Like, run jump? And get more momentum? Yes, we can. More momentum. That's better. Everybody loves momentum. We're going to go up this way. I made this path for a reason. It's supposed to take us all the way back up. All the way... Oh, no! Oh, we can't run over single blocks like in Spelunky. That'd be cool, but that's understandable. You can't, you can't make a mining game exactly like another mining game. There have to be little intricacies about it, and this has so much that Spelunky doesn't that makes it its own game. And I, I know that's probably a, a bad thing to refer to it as Spelunky, but I am a Spelunky addict. I mean, I any mining game, it's kind of like when people refer to Terraria as the 2D Minecraft. That's kind of like me referring to this as an RPG Spelunky. It's not widely accepted and probably not the correct thing to do, but, you know, when you play enough of a game and you see another game with, uh, like, influences from it, it's hard not to. Like, I play Terraria. I don't, I played Minecraft when I was, like, a few years ago. I played a lot of it, but Terraria is way better. Anyone who disagrees, let me know if you prefer which one. I mean, whatever whatever suits your palate, I guess. Every gamer's a gamer. So you found one of Joe's caves, did you? Don't know what unnatural stuff he was up to down there. Cogs and steam that I get. What's well, steampunk, man? He meddled with some weird things he did. Sometimes I'd let him stack some of it up here in me store. Weird glowing stuff. Orbs! I'd rather seen him store it in the cave he dug deeper down. What'll you have, then? I didn't sell my stuff. Sorry, Cranky. Explore another cave. <gasps> is that the cave we just found? If it is, we're not doing it yet. We'll do that next episode. We're gonna get some loot first. Dang! What's that on your feet? Those are speed boots. I'm the robotic Minin' Sonic. Do some rhyming. 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 Rhyming! Use your mouth, Scott! Dang, I never seen, I never seen anything quite like that. Did you find that in the cave? You think Joe left it in there for you? You got a man's voice, I'm sorry. Maybe there's more down there in the mine somewhere. Did you show it to my father? You really should. I did. Are we leveling up? No. We're not even close. We didn't get lots. We didn't get, like, any loot. Herm. Herm is what it's called when a guy gets a perm. Oh, I'm sorry. That That's enough of that. I'm even getting annoyed with it. I apologize so much. And I'm turning it off for the other reason, which is the Brewers are losing at the moment. Son of a bee. Turn it off. Turn that ringtone off. Even though it's giving me Metal Gear Solid flashbacks. Um, we're gonna get the Copper Pickaxe, there's no doubt about that. I wanna spend some orbs and know what they do. I'm also pretty curious why we couldn't use the ladder in that cave. Like, maybe we have to go back there once we get other stuff. I feel... I feel like him healing us right now is kind of redundant. But there's also that itch in the back of my head that's like, Uh, dude, you're gonna need it later on. <laughs> like those boots you've gotten. Bet you're quick as, gre as a greased-in steam hog with a mon. Oh, Lola. Oh, she's got, like, the, the reverse Marilyn mark. The Monroe mark, or whatever you want to call it. That mole right on right on the left side of her bottom lip. Ooh. Ooh, Lola. Look at me getting attracted to a robot. No, I'm not. The only robot I've ever been attracted to is really no robot. I can't think of... I, I was try, I was gonna make a joke, but I can't even think of a ro female robot at the moment. Which, I guess, there is no such thing, because robots are robots, I guess. But, um... There's a big 
hole down here that we haven't explored yet. Like, so we'll just go straight down from here. Seems like a good plan. Lots of stuff, and then we'll maybe loop around to the other cave. Oh, that's not even the cave he wanted us to go into. So, we are going to loot as much as we can before we get there. Like that stuff. Maybe we'll get some more of that uh, bronze stuff. I didn't check how much that iron stuff was worth. If you guys know... Oh, ho, ho, that's what I like. Citrine. Oh, that's what we like. That's the stu That's the stuff, man. Oh, there's loot there, too. Right below us. We'll have to loop around there. Um, ooh. I'm gonna jump up, see if there's anything above us. Eh, eh, eh. Nothing, just boulders. Okay. Okay. Grab this. Uh, I'm losing so much, so a track of what I'm talking about. This game is ridiculously addicting. Like, I can't even describe it to you guys. I can't get that. Yes, I can. I'm dumb. Wow, that was a lapse in attention. Grab it like this. <laughs> Ironium. I have to call it that because it's my, my mouth does not let me do it the way it's probably supposed to be pronounced, which is like Ironium or it just it, yeah, it's it's not not my my thing I do. Um, well, j j j j nothing looks like it's up there. Jump up there. Nope. Okay, well check the floor here real quick. If there's any loot real close nearby. Nope, I'm going in the cave. We'll explore this cave before we end the episode. We'll explore this cave, go up, sell our stuff, do the, do our thing, and we'll explore that next cave that we're supposed to possibly next episode. I don't know. <gasps> oh, ladder mechanics. Look how cute he is going up and down that. E -e 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 -e. This thing. Urgh. What is that water thing? Um, this? I'm not going to go in the water, because I'm not sure if we can live in the water. I should test it out just to see, but I'm not going to, because I'm a robot. Oh! Okay, <laughs> well, on accident, I find out we can go in the water. Ah, it's so just... Come on, harness your Castlevania powers. Use your platforming skills, Scott. So bad, so bad. Is there something that I'm supposed to do with the water? I'm not even supposed to be in here yet. Maybe there's a, a power or an upgrade that we don't have yet. But I'm going to try my damnedest, at least until I get sick of it. Oh, oh, I had it. Okay, we can do it, we can do it, I had it. Oh, goodness. Oh, this this has way more yellow on it than the other things did. It's going to be good. What's it going to be? It's going to be Mithril. Uh, oh, well. <gasps> well, damn you. Tra I'm, oh, no cursor. No cursor. Get used to the interface. Get used to the interface. X. Okay. Citrine. My favorite of the things. Um, Shift is run. So we're going to run up here. Oh, there's stuff up there. I saw a light. I know I did. Oh, and I am just so good at this. So good. You know what? We'll use a lantern. We'll use a... Oh, wrong button. We can't! Oh, we can't use stuff in these caves. There's gotta be a way. Gotta be a way. I'm convinced. You know what? I'm not doing that. I'm not gonna shift jump up there. I know we just got those things, but I'm gonna crawl up here because this ladder animation is so cute. All right, go sell our stuff, and that'll probably be the end of this episode of uh, Steam World Dig. Let's not this way. Oh yeah, that way. That way is the way to go. Because then we can loop around. Speed boots it. Speed boots it. <laughs> this is so fun. This is so fun, guys. Buy this game. I mean, there's so much value here for the price. The the indie games are taking over the world and that's I've been an indie fan for a long time even before like the indie wave really hit I've been playing indie games and uh, I'm, I'm glad that they erupted the way they did because they deserve it they deserve it all the way uh, save save or, uh, sell and save what do you got for me I got a level up that's what I got look at that guys 
We're level four, and we got the coal lantern. Whatever that does, it's probably a more powerful lantern. Probably lasts longer. Top of the morning. Oh, cranky. You're right here, bud. You're right in my heart. What do we got? Coal? Oh, we didn't get it yet. We have to buy it for 75 gold and three orbs. 60 second light duration. If we upgrade your furnace to burn coal instead of wood, it'll shine a wee bit longer. He said we. He's awesome. Lamp, ladders. We gotta buy more lamps. I know that much, but... Oh, what's first? Coal lantern, big pouch. Coal lantern, big pouch. Big pouch is definitely coming first. But the bronze pick ass... It, pick ass. Oh, dear. It's about time this episode ended. I just said pick ass. The bronze pickaxe is only three gold away. Oh, we can get that before the episode even ends. Let's run down there and get some real quick loot. Before the episode ends, we're gonna get some quick loot. And buy the bronze pickaxe before this ends. It's a race for loot. Race for loot. Down, down, down. Wee! Come on. Come on, all the loot. Where's the loot? There's some loot. There's not some loot. Go down. Loot. Bad guy. Gotta be looting your bad guy, right? There's some loot. Oh. And a break a brick. That's what I'm calling those. It's a break a brick. Got some fuel. Get some loot. Copper. Not not good enough. Sorry. Uh, one more. Come on. I'm not too afraid to run this game a little longer on the episode times as I am with other ones. Because this game isn't like other indie titles. This game can take some time. That's not what I want to hit. Oh, now we got to break this. Go in here. Uh, can we get some good stuff? Ooh, is that the Ironium? Yes, it is. Oh, there's our, there's our lantern. We are not set up for this, I don't think. Let's try. Let's see what this does. Might as well. Is that, is that, yep. Okay, there it is. Oh, and that is ours. Does the ladder stay there? Oh, it's so good. Okay, this, this <laughs> I'm sorry guys. I'm not I'm not making a two-part episode with one time limit. We're going to go run run back upstairs, sell this, uh, get our stuff. And then uh, we'll end this for now. Look at that. I'm getting so used to these controls already. I suppose I've been playing it for about an hour straight without real anytime real breaks, which I shouldn't be too you know, worried about. I mean, hell, Day 9's day off. He plays not games non-stop for like eight hours straight with only like marginal three-minute break, three minute breaks in between, so maybe someday I'll do that. Like, I'll sign up. I'll go on Twitch and do some streams. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm, I'm really com considered, compared to the other guys, I'm pretty much YouTube young, so best engaged rate in town. Well, the only one. Yeah, really. 26, 73. Okay, so we could almost buy that coal lantern, but that's not what I'm worried about. Herm, this is it. Plus two ground damage. Adding a bit of tin to that blade should strengthen it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and we're still at 23. We're still at 23. Oh, look at that. Right away, another plus two. Now, this is some premium grade metal. I'm... We're going for the big pouch next. I mean, this this should be done. We're going to do the coal lantern next. I mean, because that'll last longer. We're going a bit deeper. So, carrying more is a good thing. But the light lasting longer is way better. So, game saved. We're going to walk over here. Go into this. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you are enjoying this even half as much as I am. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Uh, that would be much appreciated. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more from me and keep getting more. Uh, that helps me out because then it motivates me to make more. And uh, obviously leave a comment below. I, I love getting feedback from you guys. Uh, let me know what this game reminds you of. Let me know if it's your style of game. If you bought it because of this, this Let's Play, that'd be awesome. I'd love to spread the word on indie games. That's why I'm doing these. Uh, yeah, this is going to go for a long time. I might actually stop now and play again tomorrow but yeah this this is this is absolutely fantastic thank you guys again this is penta hybrid and i'll catch you later